My name is Miss Morris. I'm a, high, a 10th grade math teacher and we're at E3 Civic High in the downtown library. What's unique about E3 is that we're a project-based school and we're a STEAM school. Um, we also have a really unique location located on the 6th and 7th floor of the downtown central library which allows us to be engaged in the downtown community and also have access to all the resources that are in the library. Um, E3 is a STEAM school. We try to integrate art into all of our contact, content areas, including math and science. Um, what kind of maker am I? Well, I'm, I haven't made a lot of things. I'm trying to be a maker. I, I've made some, I really like engineering. I really like building things for myself. And I try to get, I'm trying to get more and more involved. I'm not so much of a creative person, so my projects don't always come out the way I want them to look. But I love the experience of actually building something for myself and actually getting my hands dirty rather than just buying something at the store. Um, right now my math students are working on creating pictures using equations of lines and using actually different equations. Um, so they'll use equations of lines and equations of parabolas in order to create an image, in order to create some piece of artwork by actually writing their equations. I think the future of education at the high school level is really um, going towards project-based and creating, having students create something for themselves. So demonstrating their learning through creation. Because when their end goal is being able to create a picture or create a, um, a cardboard cutout of their design, they're really allowed to take ownership of their learning rather than completing a test. So having them be engaged in a project really makes them, it makes them take ownership of their learning, but also it makes them want to succeed a lot more rather than just getting an A on a test or completing all of their homework.